Hey yo, welcome back to the channel boys. Welcome back. I don't even know what to say. Honestly, I'm not even prepared to vlog at the moment. I kind of just grabbed the camera. I'm out running errands right now actually. I gotta run to the supermarket and I gotta run to Lowe's. Lowe's is for a specific reason. I'll get into that after. I'm gonna take you guys with me to Lowe's. Uh, as this car gets older by the way, it gets really rattly everywhere. I don't like it. Mm -mm. I don't like it, but guess what? We on the journey to saving for the new car, finally. We're on the journey. Now that we're back from the cruise and everything's all done and all the vacations are set and done with, I don't have to waste my money on that anymore, which honestly, it was worth it. So I mean, I'm not gonna complain. But we can finally save for the new car. It's coming shortly on the channel. Be prepared for that. But upon request today, upon request, today we are going to do some drive-bys with the Passat because all you guys give us so much love on those Passat videos and the exhaust and what I've done to the car and apparently more people have Passats than I thought out there. I did not expect you guys having all these Passats. Apparently you guys have Passats. I didn't think this car would be worthy for this freaking channel to be completely honest, but apparently it is. It's, it's worthy enough to be on the channel and you guys want me to give it more love and I'm gonna give it more love. So today we're gonna put the camera down on the ground. We're gonna do some exquisite drive-bys. I'm looking for an area right now, and I think I found some good spots. I just gotta find a spot to turn around. It's kinda hard with the camera on my hand. But I'm gonna find some spots. We're gonna do some wonderful drive-bys. So the next clip is me doing some drive-bys. Be prepared, hopefully it sounds good, picks up on camera. I'm gonna try the best I absolutely can with it. So just, you know, bear with me. That was incredibly hard. I found a good spot, but it got busy with cars. So I had to like turn around. I had to do all this like maneuvering. Whew, that was complex. And I really hope it sounds good on camera. I have no idea how that sounds. I hope that's better. Um, that was extremely hard to do. And the problem was I didn't have a lot of roads to turn on. So I was like going far away from the camera and it was, since it was such a busy road, I'm like, oh, someone's gonna see it and just grab it and then I'm gonna go back and be like, oh my God. It was really sketchy for me. I don't know how I felt about that. I'm gonna do some more revving clips, I think, actually, as of right now. I'm gonna go a little bit more aggressive than I did in the last video. That way you guys can really hear it and maybe this one will sound better. <laughs> Semi truck or dump truck. Woo, stinky. Boy, she's stinky. All right, I did not know this road was going to be that busy at this time because it never usually is. So I don't know what the heck, what the heck is going on? This road is super busy. Wow, I went really aggressive on that. Of course, the in between park and reverse trick, as like I've been telling you guys, always do the in between park and reverse. Left foot on the brake, right foot on the gas, have fun. That's the way to do it. And I hope that's clear enough. I put the camera a little bit further back than I did last time. I kept it pretty close last time. This time I moved it back further. So I hope that clarifies everything for you. If not, then we're gonna do some quick clips with Adam on a road, me driving back and forth. Um, but I hope that clears it up for you guys. I hope that sounds good. I, I guess I have no idea how that sounds yet. I'll pray to God it sounds good. I hope it does. I worked really hard on those drive-bys and yeah, pretty crazy. But now I'm gonna go to Lowe's because I have to purchase these little wire hider things. They're called like wire hider, I don't, I don't, I don't really know what they're called. 
But they're like these little strips that have 3M tape on the back of it. You pull the tape off, put it on the wall, and then it has this little plastic cover on it. You pull the cover off, it has this little thing that you uh, sneak the wires into. So you put all the wires into it and then put the cover on it so it hides all the wires. And I'm gonna get that for my desk because my desk has way too many wires. It's too cluttered, it looks awful. And I'm gonna go and pick up a little pack. They Sometimes, sometimes they sell them in like big packs of like 10 or 12. I don't really need that many, but I'll pick it up. And then we gotta go to the grocery store, I gotta pick up some milk, and then I gotta pick up some tuna. We're out of tuna, and we're out of milk. But, welcome back, boys. That's a great way to start off the welcome back from our cruise. Really, 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 really good way to do it. Um, but yeah, we had a great time on the cruise, and like I said, we came back, I don't even know what to do now. I don't even know what to say. I'm like, just the vacation was crazy. It was amazing. And then we come back, and we have you know a lot of other things to do in our personal lives. And, we're trying to figure it all out, trying to get it all sorted out for you guys and trying to get our content. We're getting subscribers lately and we're not even posting a lot of content, so we appreciate you guys. If anybody here is new to the channel, we are Real Speed. We make car content and lifestyle content. Uh, lifestyle content includes like vacationing, uh, just doing random things like washing the cars, going on like, you know, limiting road trips, events, car events you know, doing pulls with the cars as like this video, you know, going out and having fun, going to bars, going bowling. We do a whole bunch of fun stuff, but mainly we do car content. But as of right now, Adam drives a 2017 Subaru WRX that he's currently selling. So we will have a new car on the channel. So if you guys are brand new, make sure to hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it, of course, as usual, and comment, make sure to comment. like comment your opinions like you guys always do on the Passat and on opinions on what car Adam should buy next because he does he's still up in the air on it he has options but he's up in the air on what he wants he doesn't know so you know I know you guys love to give the Passat love and comment about it and everything but while you're commenting say hey maybe Adam should buy this car maybe Adam should buy that car so just let us know or let him know really what he should buy give him an opinion if you're gonna swipe up and comment about the Passat you know, put a little PS thing and say, hey, Adam should buy a BMW M3, or he should buy an RS3, or he should buy, a, you know, a GTR, he should buy, let him know what you think he should buy. Ah, I got it. Let's go. All right, well, they're a little big. So they're essentially called cord hiders. And they're these little tiny little skinny things. They're pretty long, you cut them and you can just, Stick the wires in between them and then you take the 3M tape off the back, which is kind of hard to show you on camera because it blends in with the actual thing. But you take off the 3M tape here and then you just stick it onto the wall and it hides all your wires and keeps it looking pretty clean. So now I gotta figure out a way to put these somewhere. Oh, okay. Okay. They're just gonna they're just gonna they're just, they're just gonna go there. That's that's just what's that's just what's gonna happen. They're just gonna they're just gonna go there. You know, my, I'm, I've given up. It's fine. I drive a boat and it still feels like it's too damn small. That's why we need a shark. I mean, not for stupid little things like that, but in general, for a lot of the things that we've bought over the years, we need a truck. That's gonna help. I can put the stick back on. There we go. You see me mid vlog putting on the stick. Three, two, one. Ah, oh, so much better. Look at that. Now I'm on my way to the grocery store. I gotta get milk and tuna. But for you boys, one more time in the vlog. One more time. Oh, I hate doing this. It's the worst part, right? I gotta put the seatbelt on and then I gotta put it like this. So, what I need to do is I'm gonna do one more drive by right over here for you guys. One more drive by for the boys. And I figured just in case that wasn't enough back there, well, it'll be enough now. Also, quick update. My car is going in the shop within the next week to get repainted and the bumper replaced on it. So that's a sign, that's a, that's a plus sign right there. I mean, I don't really care. I mean, the car is gonna be going bye-bye anyway, but I did get it all for free because, you know, he hit me and the insurance company, his insurance company paid for it. So like, I get it, I get it. I get the morals of it or the principles of it, whatever you wanna call it, I get it. But like, I personally don't care just cause like, it's just a, like two little dents and like a couple scratches and the car's going bye-bye anyway. So I'm not really too concerned, but I do get a rental car, so you're gonna see the rental car on the channel for a little while. I don't know, yeah, well, depending on what it is, we'll have some fun with it. We'll see. Hey, 
I got it. I got it. Turn the. There we go. Oh, it's so sketchy doing that. I got people driving by and all this. It's so sketchy, man. All right, time to go home. Oh, sorry. It's time to go to the grocery store. Then I go home. Nope. Tune up. Acquired. Time to go home, boys. Yeah, I'm gonna run around. Time to go home. And we're back home, and I just put all of the wire hiders on, and it looks as good as I can make it. I mean, let me show you. Take a look. So I put one there, I put one there, and I put one there. Obviously, I'm not gonna hide that. Uh, one wire is for this computer charger, which that computer charger may have to come out if I move the computer around, and uh, one of them is for this. And if I put it in the wire hider thing, in the holder, I wouldn't be able to slide this back and forth. So I kept that free. But honestly, it looks pretty good. You know, besides the wires all right here, I mean, I did the best I could. Obviously, they're dangling there too. I mean, it is what it is, but instead of having it dangling all through here, all of them, and then have all that, now I just have that. So it's really not that big of a deal. You know, looks pretty good. You can't go wrong, 10 bucks for two of those. And I got the extra one over there. I can use that for my bedroom. I have some wires for my TV in my bedroom I can hide, and just some extra, some extra pieces, you know what I'm saying? Check out the vibes right now, you already know. Um, a little update on the desk since I haven't in a while. I put a sound bar in instead of using the home theater system I was using. So I put a sound bar in, mounted it up top. I know it's not perfectly aligned. I'm sorry about that. It's okay. Uh, it comes with a subwoofer too. And then I also kind of like reconfigurated this whole area. It looks better, obviously, featuring the Celtics Bear. Pretty cool. I got that out of game. The RSR uh, pamphlet with the Porsche section opened up because the, I don't like Civics, so I had to choose that section. Um, a painted picture of me, Adam, and our other best friend, Katie, kinda cool. Uh, Dustin Williams photo I framed, which is pretty sick. Our vision board, and then this like light thing, I don't know, it's kinda cool, I guess, I don't know. Aesthetic, you know, you look for the aesthetics, you know what I'm saying? Obviously the LED lights behind it. I need suggestions from you guys. I need new LED lights in here, these are cheap and I hate them. And I wanna put new lights there just cause like I'm not a big fan of them anymore. So I need suggestions. If you guys have any suggestions of what lights I should go with, it doesn't matter what the price is. They could be expensive ones, they could be cheaper ones. I just need suggestions because I'm not a fan of these. These were $20 off of Amazon. They like the, the brand was called Govee, G-O-V-E-E. -E. Not a fan. Um, but yeah, other than that, that's a good desk update. I'm actually gonna edit this video right now and post it for you guys tomorrow. And then tomorrow, me and Adam are gonna vlog. Saturday vlogs, as usual, we're back home, not on the ship anymore. So our Saturday vlogs will be back to normal as per usual. You'll see those on Sunday or Monday, one of the two days they're posted, depends on what's going on on Saturday. But, with that being said, boys, thank you so much for watching today's video, and we will see you in the next one. Peace.